That's just the intro to the game. Welcome to Fable Town, achievement unlocked. Well, thank you. Telltale Games presents. That is the intro. So, what do you guys think so far? That looks fucking. I feel like this is gonna be amazing. I really do. Telltale Games knows how to tell some stories, man. Holy shit. Dun 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 Look at that city. And I'm the big bad sheriff. Episode one. Faith. Oh, I gotta walk. Okay. My bad. I'm not even paying attention. So wait, here's my... Are these my apartments? Oh yeah, these are the woodland apartments. Enter the gate. Let me look at this, make sure... Alright, go inside. I like the new gameplay, or the new kind of HUD that they give you, the controls. It's so much better than the, the Walking Dead game. It's so much, like, smoother, and I, I like that there could be different options, like, on the wheel. The combat system was a lot better, too. Oh. Yo, what's up, creepy little girl in the tree? Oh, is that little Red Riding Hood? Don't make me come over there. Look, I've got an hour of paperwork ahead of me, and I've already had to deal with one asshole tonight, so just... <gasps> Sorry, Big B. Oh, what's up? Good looking. An asshole. Beauty. Hello, Big B. Beauty. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd, but there's an explanation. So, where are you off to? Well, I went for a walk. I don't see what's wrong with that. Didn't say there was. It's not a big deal. Just, you know. Out. Beauty and the Beast? For a walk. That's all. Damn it. I'm late. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast oh, you saw me. Oh, shit. He worries too much as it is, and... Sure. Promise. You promise? I promise. Thank you, Big B. I'll explain it all to you later. I will. But if you get raped, it ain't my fault. That's your- that's on you, beauty. Thank you. For trusting me. Really, I- I appreciate it. Apparently the hairy beast isn't good enough for her. She's going out looking for someone else. He does look a little bit like Joel from The Last of Us, with long hair. Kinda has the same facial structure. <laughs> hey, get your feet down, you shit! Scumbag security guard. Look at this guy. What does it say? What's his name? Suit of armor? Touch? Sure. What happens if I touch it? Will it fall? Oh, it's gonna wake him up. This son of a bitch. Let's talk to him. Hey, you wink? Grimble. Hmm, probably for the best. Okay. Open that mailbox, baby. Been a while since I got any mail. Aww. Seventh day in a row. No friends. Nobody. Building directory. Mr. and Mrs. Beast, 301. Corner, beard. Oh, I was trying to look at all the names. Damn it. Elevator. Is there anything else in here that I missed? Yeah, let's just go to the elevator. Let's go up to our apartment. We gotta get ready for the, the little cutie to come back to us. Wait for the elevator. Wait for the elevator. Uh. Uh, going up that elevator. The hell? Oh. 
Bigby. Hey, wait up. Oh no, this is Beast. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Uh. So. Have I haven't you? seen her. Nope. Haven't seen her. Oh. Okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. He does look like a beast. <laughs> Jesus, dude was huge. I didn't want to piss him off. Except for I just lied to him, so I'm gonna end up fighting him for fucking lying. Damn. 204. Big B's apartment, Fable Town. Wow. Damn. This is a shithole. What the hell? Wasn't the window already open? That was weird. Ugh. Gotta dry off all that blood. I clean off all the blood. What a night. It's alright, you got that that fine ass that fine ass honey coming over. You better clean this shithole. Seriously Whoa. Oh, we got some ice cubes. Anybody wants some anybody wants some ice? Actually we don't have any ice cubes. Just lick the the you know, the freezer. That's what I do. Huff and puff. The fuck is does he even eat? Huff and puff, get it? The big bad wolf. Oh, okay, maybe I have no. Um, blue bluebeard folder. Use bluebeard. Bluebeard's file. Never trusted this guy. Chinese food. I remember ordering that. Probably a bad sign. Ugh. Let's turn on this fan and get some air going through it, man. Should help. Should help the stent. What the? <laughs> what the fuck? Hi, Colin. <laughs> what? Wake him up. Colin, wake up, you fat fucker. Uh, oh, hey, Big B. <laughs> I'm in your chair, huh? Oh. <laughs> yeah, get out. Get out. Ooh. That ain't no little pig. That's a big ass pig. Oh, he's in my pet. I don't get it. Got a smoke? You don't need one, Colin. You're a pig. Smoking, Thanks. smoking pig. A thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Big B. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Come on, that's a little dramatic. Uh oh. Sorry, Colin. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Go <laughs> with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh, it would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. <laughs> sip, the, sip the drink. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I'm a dick. Take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. <laughs> oh man. It wasn't murder. I was hungry. Yeah, well I'm hungry now. You don't see me tearing the flesh off of your bones. But you would if you could. Oh. Oh. Probably. But uh no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. 
You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, we're scared of you. You're a talking pig. Hands. What? They're bloody. Nothing wrong with my hands. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. It wasn't my fault. I get the impression you say that a lot. I don't care if Colin is unimpressed, game. Fuck you, you Colin. My job is easy. You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. <laughs> it's embarrassing. <laughs> That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Mm, not everyone. Name one. Beauty. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I told her I'd lie for her. Right. Yeah. That's real nice. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Life oh. is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. <laughs> Wait, that doesn't make Just give sense. me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I. Look, if I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Give it to him. Here, take the drink, you fucker. Thanks, Big B. <laughs> Fucking gross. <sighs> that beard. That five o'clock shadow. I don't know why, but I feel like the storyline is going to be so fucking good. Oh, it's the it's the crazy bitch. Or not the crazy bitch. Crazy hot bitch. I'm just kidding. She's not a B I T C H. She's the fine young lady who just sucks dick for money, you know? I'm gonna show her the big bad wolf. Big B. Snow. Come with me. What do you want, Snow White? Damn, Snow, what's up, girl? Snow. Snow. What? Sorry, I'm. What is it? What happened? happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to. Oh fuck! Bye. Who's this? Hello. Good morning or evening. <laughs> yeah. Is that Ron Weasley? Who is this? These walls are paper thin. Tell me what's going on, Snow White. Be careful. We'll talk outside. Talk outside. Oh yeah. Whoa, whoa, what the fuck is that? On the steps. Wait, what? Does, did that say sheriff on it? Is it my jacket? Oh, security. Oh, no. What happened to the security guard? Not a Mundy, right? Who was she? I thought I knew everyone in Fable Town. 
She looks familiar. Just a girl. We didn't have a whole lot of time to chat. What the fuck? What's in her mouth? The woodsman. He attacked her and I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. You don't think he... I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just... terrible. So, who found her? I did. She was just like this. I didn't touch her. I grabbed Grimble's jacket to cover her with. Then, I came to get you right away. No one else was with you? No. Big P, did one of... us? Do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know what's going on. I'll have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through here. The fuck is going on? There's something, yeah. What is this? Is that a piece of gum or like a piece of paper? Yeah, grab it. Oh man, this is gruesome as fuck. It's oh, it's a fruit roll-up. A ribbon. Oh, it's a ribbon with a There's some kind of symbol here. Huh. I I don't recognize it. Neither do I. Wisco just subscribed. Thank you. Okay, now I have a. You see him in the name's cut. What did Oh man. Do? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp or something with magic attached to it. Yeah, let's check out her eyebrows. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed for us to find. For you to find. A monster would do this. Some fucked up monster, that's that's who. The huntsman, but that would be too obvious. Oh, there's some blood. It's not the huntsman, that would be way too obvious. It's beast! I'm I'm sorry. This is just so surreal. <sighs> um what It's calling the pig. What do you want to do next? Investigate more. I still have some time. I should keep investigating the area. Okay, good idea. Okay. But Snow, you you a sexy girl, for sure. So blood trail right here. Blood, drops of blood. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. Oh, what is that? Do do do. Oh, the garbage can. What is this? Scrap of fabric. No signs that it's been here long. Grab it. Fabric. Looks like jeans. Doesn't tell me much. Well, maybe her body is in the trash can. Nothing. That'd be too obvious. Wait. What's on the top of that? Blood. Shit. Someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, and left the trail I found earlier. Can we jump over? Oh no, just touch the blood. Still wet. Whoever it is, cut the someone cut themselves. Maybe she killed herself. <laughs> She cut her own head off, it rolled all the way to the stairs, and that's just how it ended up there. You know, that seems like the most logical thing. Show... wait, compare... compare fabric. What are you doing? I'm looking at your... To be thorough. Your vagina. Sure, just... hurry up. We don't have much time. And eh, not the same fabric. Not a match. Can we? We should. We should like cover her up. Her before anyone shows up, we'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. 
Pigpy, do you have any idea what's going on? This is a message. A message? I don't know, Bigby. I get complaints at the office all the time, but... Just what about this makes you think that? Whoever did this isn't exactly hiding it. The placement of the head? It's exact. Purposeful. She was placed here precisely for us to find. All of us. Well... Yes. I guess you're right. The killer wanted us to know what they had done. Yeah. Snow agrees with me. One step closer to her panties, guys. I'm gonna We're on the well on the way. This. Who's Crane? As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And is that your boyfriend? I don't like him. Anyway, so we may as well get out in front of it. It'll just be worse if he finds out we held it from him. I know you don't like him, but he's our boss. This Fine. Is part of the job. I guess it's useless to drag it out. That's how I feel too. I'm sure he won't be happy, but it's just part of the process. Hopefully he can be rational about it. I wouldn't hold my breath. <sighs> I'm not. I just don't want him interfering. He's probably going to. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. Yes, ma'am. BG Dubs, you look great in that dress. Skirt. Whatever.